Hello, and welcome to another Steam Next Fest demo. I've said that so many times I don't know how to say it normally, so... Uh, <laughs> this time we are checking out Enshrouded. I have played, as you can tell, I played a little bit of it. Um, mostly just to kind of get a feel for it. And I, I... I enjoyed the little bit I played. And I played very bare bones of it, but basically, from what I can tell so far, it's like an action RPG um, that plays closer to, like, the the new Legend of Zelda games like Tears of the Kingdom and uh, Breath of the... Breath of the Wild? Yeah. Um, but there's also, like... There's like a like base building stuff. I think I don't know. We'll we'll play it and we'll we'll uh, we'll you know we'll uh, go from there. Huh? Private. Uh, let's create a new world. Oh, okay. My world too. I don't get to make a new character. I don't get to make a new character. Oh, okay, I mean, that's fine, whatever. But we get to... Nope, we have everything. Okay, hold on. Uh, return to main menu. I mean, normally that's... Okay, change. There we go. Here 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 we go. Okay. Preset. I need... A man body. Bam. New hair. Whoa. Uh, try to make this quick. Uh, 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 uh. Nice. That'll go great with a giant fucking beard. Perfect. I think he looks exactly like Feld, so never mind. Let's change it up just a tiny bit. There we go. Now he looks more Vikingish. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I like it takes like a whole second for them to play the female voice. Oh, there we go. Uh, we'll call this. Steam. Next. Fest. So we'll just change some stuff around. There we go. <laughs> Stefan. Create. Beautiful. We are now Stefan. All right. Private game. We'll play My World to it. I don't think it really matters. Mostly just want you to see the intro, which I think you're literally just coming out of a pod. So it's not like a, a huge thing. Yeah. Okay. You're just literally leaving some kind of weird ceramic pod pot thing. Whoa. The graphics are a little wanky. Wanky, is that the word? I don't think that's the word I want to use. Hold on. Okay, I think that looks a little bit better. All right. If it starts to chug, we'll bring it down one, but... Just did not look great. So, um... At some point, there's, like, some kind of thing that tells you, Hey, you gotta go do this. Oh, here we go. One marker is added. Commune with the flame. What is this, Dark Souls? The flame. You've slumbered for too long, Flameborn. The realm of Embervale has fallen, consumed by the Shroud. Now the enduring flame calls for you. Find a place in the ruined world and construct a flame altar to create shelter from the dark. Yeah, okay. He's got some jumps. Some massive leaps. On the flame and its murmurs, pure light engulfs the knowledge of the ancient breed protecting it in a flaming core. Wisdom far beyond my own imagination, I could stare into the fire for hours, seeking answers. A whisper, but I hear none. Despite possessing a voice, it only speaks to those born from the flame. 
A shame, as I believe we could have enlightened conversations. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Gotta claim a spot for my base. A fast world awaits you. Fill the secrets. Press start to open your map and track your discoveries. I have nothing. I have no... No discoveries. I haven't discovered shit. I forget how to climb. I think there's a climbing button, too. But yeah, like, it jumps like Legend of Zelda, and the combat is similar to Legend of Zelda. Bandage. Do you even open up? I just noticed you open up treasure chests like Legend of Zelda. <laughs> Whoa! Look at all that light. All right, let's see here. Use a terraforming tool or explosives to forge a path through the rubble. Explosive powder balls can be thrown. How do I? D pad. That's right. And then you just there's no aiming. I think from what I can tell. Yeah, you just literally throw it. I wish you could aim it, but... There we go. Sweet. We can save a couple. Alright, what's in the chest? Give me the chest. Ooh, a sword. Um, K.O. to peak med. Blah, blah, blah. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Yum, yum, yum. That's exactly what it said. <laughs> but hey, a sword's pretty handy. Oh, there's a dodge. Nice. We like a good dodge. We love a good dodge, too. Alright, before I go down there, let's go back up this way. See if there's anything to discover. It does not seem so. It looks like it's just... Same path, but around. Oh, never mind. It's the other side of the path that we were on. Okay. Let's go this way. The flame allows you to resist the shroud, but if you linger, you will perish. Escape the shroud to replenish your maximum time in the shroud. I picked up another torch. Okay, I'm like, what did I pick up? <laughs> Ew, grody. Oh, those are mushrooms? I thought they were just like snails that were like half out for some reason. Okay, press R3 to the K. Beautiful. Okay. Oh my wow, moi shenderu. Whoa. My man teleported over there. Do they all have loot? Ooh, a shield. Hmm. Oh, here. Duh. And a rusty short sword? Whoa. We got all kinds of weapons out here. Oh, okay. That's fair. Gotta be careful when you just stab things. Can't just stab everything in life. That's not how a functional society should work. I don't know where I was going with that. I do want to, because I have I don't remember getting the shield before. So I just automatically equip it. Nice! Look at me! I'm the hero of time. If you fall, you will rise again at your last return beacon. Okie dokie. Yeah. Look, it's got the stamina wheel from Legend of Zelda. Hmm. 
Nice stone. Gotta conserve our stamina. Don't want to use it all up. Okay, claim a spot for your base. So now I need to make the flame altar. I need more stone. I gotta get more stone. Okay, here we go. I'm assuming it wants me to place it here. How do I place? A? Eh? Nope. Um. X. Of course. Commune with a flame. You are not alone. There are other survivors drowsing in nearby ancient vaults. Find them so they may aid in your journey. Go gently. One beckons nearby, just outside of the shroud, Shroud's grasp. Okay. Uh-oh. I see a health bar over here. That means somebody's getting fucked up. I gotta tell you something. Hold on, actually, you know what? I can finally use my... I'll tell you something. I'm getting pretty sick and tired of all the dumb things that go on around here. This is no place for a strong, tough, and terrific boy like myself. I heard that on a TikTok the other day, and I've been obsessed with it ever since then. Because it reminds me of my Bowie. Wolf dead. Dead wolf. Ugh. Ugh. I pulled my chest somehow. That's impressive. Ow. Oh, God. I feel like I pulled my sternum. Oh, my God. Ah, uh, this is what got fucked up. Some goat was murdered by the wolf, I bet. Man, it'd be a lot easier if I had, like, a, a glider or something. <laughs> Can I just have a glider? If we're already doing the Legend of Zelda thing. What's this? What are you? Oh, weird little bunnies. Well, here's a whole ass camp. That's the smallest barrel I've ever seen. No, I don't want to sleep. Hmm, bandage. The raiders have besieged us past two days, attacking from their eyes, such madness. Da -da 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 -da. There's bandits, and they're crazy. They're crazy bandits. Got a lot of health items. I hope I don't fucking die. Hmm. You can't proceed without a grappling hook. Seek a path through the shroud instead. Okay. Guess I'll just go fuck myself. Uh-huh. Read. We are hungry. We had to destroy the bridge. And with it, our connection to supplies. But it worked. We haven't seen more scavengers. Okay, they destroyed the bridge because they couldn't handle the bandits. Who call themselves scavengers, I guess. But now I had to go through the shroud. Spooky. Stay on the path lest the shrouds can take you. Salvation lies straight ahead. I guess I should probably run, huh? No. Nice. I said to go straight ahead, so I guess I'll keep going straight ahead. I'm still in the shroud? That's some thick ass shroud.
Oh, we're about to climb. Nice try. You forgot I have a shield. Just want to see if there's anything else over here, but it appears it appears to not be. Appears there are no other things, simply one man with some kind of bow gun. Now they're stealing from Monster Hunter God. <laughs> Honestly, more games should just take aspects and certain things from other games and mix them up. It's It's kind of fun when people put their own personal twist on it. Bushes conceal you. When you're within them, press L3 to crouch and hide. Use them to sneak up on enemies. I'm so sneaky, you can't see me. I'm about to stab you in your pee-pee. There's no sneak attacks. I'm just going to attack you. Oh. Oh, no. I should block, and I should run. <laughs> Oh no! There we go. Okay. Easy enough. <laughs> you almost died. No, it's fine. Uh oh. Oh, I finally got a shirt. I do have one thing left. Well, okay. I mean, that did have his health, so I'm not. Umewa moi shinderu. Alright, let's put on our fancy new shirt. I thought I had a shirt. Did I not get a ragged shirt plus three? Am I out of my goddamn mind? Okay, well, we got a scale point. Let's see here. Sneak attack? Nope. Increase the damage you deal from behind by 25%. Failing axes do 30% more damage against wind. I like a merciless attack. Okay. Increase the amount of stamina the enemy loses when you parry their attack. So there is a parry. Nice. Yeah, sure, why not? Now, I am almost certain that there is that we have a t-shirt but where did it go or did I just unlock the recipe to make a t-shirt I guess ah uh, I see I unlocked the recipe to make a, a ragged shirt I guess weird very weird I didn't realize that was an explosive barrel. Ah. Uh, 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 <laughs> okay. Uh, montage time. <laughs> Montage. Talk about a montage. Gonna need a montage. Montage. Gonna need a montage. Montage. 
always fade out in the montage. When you fade out, it seems like time's going faster in a montage. Montage. Okay, we are back to my dead body that blew up oh so unfortunately. Hey, water. Beautiful. You love to see it. Ooh, logs. All right, let's go wake up this person after I've died. <laughs> Uh-oh. That was a little bit easier. Still took like half damage, but that's fine. Or like half of our health. But it's fine. Awaken. Oswald Anders the Blacksmith. They just... Oh, it's, sorry. It's Andre the Blacksmith from Dark Souls. <laughs> Excuse me. It's done. The center vessel is delicate trap should you still fall until you brim with potential. Thankfully, the blacksmith volunteer. He must enter the vessel and sleep until aroused, lest he slips into eternity. Okay. So. When you need a rest, you can fast travel back to your home by opening your map. Using start. Navigate to the map and select your home. My home. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Now I found him, though. So. This survival will be a worthy addition to our cause. Place him into the world with a summoning staff, which you can craft from simple twigs. Okay. I have to make a staff with twigs. Nope. Uh... Crafting. I need resin. Um, where do I get resin? Maybe from trees? Okay, well, I still need string. All right, we got a lot going on here. <laughs> yeah, I guess I could just swing at the trees with my sward. I feel like this is not the most efficient. Oh, well, we got it. Okay. Okay, we got one resin. Still need one more resin. So, nope. Okay, I was about to say this tree is so small, you can't even deal damage to it. Interesting hitbox. <laughs> and more resin. Fuck yeah. All right. It's time to make a staff. Cast spell. What am okay? 
Okay, page two. You place them in your home with a summoning staff. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, heh <laughs> Different staff, I'm sorry. That's my, my mistake. All right. Oi! What's up, Andre? At long last I return. I am a humble blacksmith at your service. Let's prepare you for what's to come. Crafting first gear. Took you long enough to find me. Look at you, weak and puny. And they call you Flameburn. First thing you need is a weapon. Lucky you woke me up first. Crafting this scrappy sword or spiked club will serve us well. Okay. Can I have a spiked club? No, I need nails. Okay. I have so many torches. Alright. Alright, what else do we need from him? Shelter. I need a proper shop to smith and only then I can craft the right equipment for you. Don't fret, it's not hard to build one. You need a workbench, some building blocks, and a construction hammer. Let's get to work. What about a cleansing fire? An ember can be still be saved where there's ashes. Embers, kid. The shroud suffocates the valleys. Da -da -da -da. Oh, hey, a glider. I was talking about that earlier. The flame doesn't give you wings, kid. Craft a glider the workbench will make good. Okay, well rested. Even with your new gear, you shouldn't feel too safe out there. Rest up and eat well before you head out. A fire, a roof over your head, and some meat in your belly will prepare you for anything. Okay. So let's go through our quests here. The blacksmith needs a shop. A workbench. Let's see, shelters so he can craft some more items. Okay, a workbench, some building blocks, and a construction hammer. So we need more string. We can at least make the construction hammer. Craft blocks at the workbench. Okay, so I still need a... Workbench. I need to make. God bless. <laughs> I need to. Uh, I need to get some string. So how do I make string? Out of plant fiber. Easy enough. So let's get some plant fiber, huh? I can't tell if I'm getting plant fiber or not. <laughs> this is the toughest, tiniest tree I've ever seen. Oh, tear it out. I can just tear it out. Oh, I can just tear all these out. I can just get plant fiber that way. Aha! I've been doing it wrong. Oh, what was that? Give me that. Give me that. Give me that stone. Oh. Oh, a firefly. Nice. I saw something about a firefly lamp earlier, but I... Uh, decided not to pay attention to it. Not even mention it at all. <laughs> until now. <laughs> 
Because I am a professional YouTuber, and nobody can stop me. Gotcha. Alright, we should have plenty of stuff to make everything we need. Or at least a start. Alright, let's make... A workbench. Oh, we could also make an axe or a pickaxe. Let's make both. It don't really matter, we'll have to move it again at some point, so let's place it there. Craft and repair. Rough wood block times a hundred. Rough stone block times a hundred. We'll probably want stone. Stone's probably stronger than uh, wood, I would say. Call me crazy. All right, let's make him a little shop here. We can make it like two blocks away from the altar here. Oh, it's not like one block is... Okay, well, so 200 is... Uh, weird. <laughs> That's definitely a way to... make those, I guess. Okay. Gonna need a lot more stone. Um, so we made some blocks. What else do we need? Oh, God bless. Okay, finish. Uh, some building blocks and a construction hammer and a workbench. So can I move this? Rotate. My hammer will fix it. Is that good enough for you? Hey, he said the thing. I can get a fur hood or some fur gloves. Hell yeah. Shoes. Okay. Workbench, some building blocks, and you'll need a first craft to place workbench in there. Craft to work. Use a craft water. Okay, da da da. These bong. Da 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 da. Craft. Then we're gonna come over there. Da 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 da. Okay, so we had to make. I guess like the full thing. I guess we probably had to like make a whole ass building. A whole ass building. Okay, so let's find some stone. Nice. I like how with the pickaxe he's not using the pick part really. Looks like he's using the heavier part. I don't know if that's what you're supposed to do with a pickaxe, but what do I know? I'm not a miner. I'm over the age of 18. <laughs> oh, God. We like to have fun here. I like to have a good time. Hmm. 
much stone do I have now? 52 stone. Well, just to be safe, I'm still going to keep chop chopping away because apparently we need a lot of stone to build stuff. I'm interested to see what happens when you, like, mine a section away from the base. Like, we'll see what this little... Okay, that just stays up there. Okay. <laughs> and some certain... Like, in Valheim, I think, like, they do... If, it, if they uh, are not connected, they stay in the air for, like, a minute, and then... Uh, they eventually, like, fall apart. I imagine that'll probably, like, happen with, um, like stuff that we build. I'm sure that had to be like on a base or something. There's 36,000 more pieces and we should be ready. <laughs> we'll get to a hundred stone here and then we'll uh, try to make do with that. Plus it wouldn't hurt just to kind of like mine away this section so we can actually see beyond this part. Sometimes I think it a little bit too tactically. Uh, like... <laughs> My first thought was like, oh, we gotta mine this way so the enemies don't have like a good vantage point, which if we were like in a in a server or something where there's like PvP, that would make sense, but I don't think these enemies, these computer guys are gonna do that. <laughs> but it, it would be nice just to kind of see further out into the the field here. One hundred and four. Okay, sweet. Yeah. Okay, now that I got almost two thousand, hopefully that's enough to make a thing. Okay, so rotate. Wrong button. You fucking fool. You absolute fool. <laughs> oh my god. Andre, could I... Bud, could I have you just... Oh my god, I keep pressing the wrong button. Now I'll just uh, place it on top of you here. I keep pressing my <laughs> God bless. <laughs> okay, um, rotate. Door frame. Now we need to make a ceiling. Do I need to make a chimney or anything? Is it that complicated? Does not seem to be that complicated. Okay, good. Oh, God. I keep doing it. This is always the tricky part of building stuff. 
Where's the snap two thing? Where's the snap? Okay. No! Oh, God. Why is it so easy to undo something versus you can't, like, redo it? Eh. Okay. Andre, my boy. Okay, you're stuck inside the wall now. That's okay. I'll talk to you over here. Anything else? Do I need to make him a door, maybe? Okay, so I need to probably make him a wood door and then we're good to go. But I need wood logs. If only I had an axe. Whoa, whoa. You'll love to see it. Yeah, sure, it's easier to uh, chop down a tree with an axe than a sword for some reason. Who could have guessed? Who could have known? Okay, you will need some illumination, though, so let's see. Can we make anything? Not really. So you'll just have to make do. Okay, that did nothing, but that's fine. <laughs> okay. What do, you, what do you want? You have awakened your can. The flame is pleased. He got more survivors stumbling in the sleep la springlands. In the sleeplands. Uh, what have you got for me? Okay, is that done? Did I do it? Okay, I did do it. So, crafting a glider can, can be rented by a workbench from Shroudwood. Okay, so I gotta get some Shroudwood. Shroudwood! Check it and see. <laughs> Maybe at some point we'll worry about making our own house, but for now... We'll, uh, go get some shroud wood. Which I imagine we can probably find some down here. Okay, yeah, it looks like I see trees, so... It's not entirely crazy to think that I could possibly... Get some shroud wood. Yeah, I, I'm sorry if I, if I haven't been talking a lot, but I'm actually enjoying the game. It's a lot of fun. Really enjoy this world, the systems. I guess this is some type of wood. Oh. I could have just torn it out. Turns out he's weak to weapons. Haha! <laughs> Let's try this big old tree. Oh, hold on. Gotcha, bitch.
Nice, shroud wood. I wish I knew how much shroud wood I need, so we'll just keep chopping, I guess. Oh, hey, another guy. Hello, friend. Damage. Oh no, my backpack is full. I guess I will have to make some kind of small chest when I get back. How much shred wood do I have? Let's try one more tree. And then we'll get out of here. Okay. I gotta get out of here. It's so shroudy. Oh, my body. My body. My body, yeah. <sighs> I was trying to remember which way I need to go, but I think it's through here. Oh, shit, it's a wolf. I only knew there was a wolf because of the <laughs> the boss music or the the enemy music. What are these little glowy guys? Fireflies? Sure enough. Get one more. I think I have enough now to make a firefly lamp. Firefly lamp. Fi fire. Hey, what are you doing out of here? Stay in your zone. Don't you be eyeballing my zone. Mind your business. Okay. I need more animal fur. Okay. I can make nails. That's not going to be too hard. But for the glider, I need more animal fur. So let's make nails so we can make a chest. Never force it. Just get a bit of cover. Okay, I need a bigger slot. That's what she said. We'll drop the bones for now. That's what you've you've said that like thirty times. <laughs> Listen, don't force it. Just get a bigger hammer. Okay, okay, Andre. Look, no, I don't think you're listening to me. Don't force it. Just get a bigger hammer. Andre, I don't I don't like hanging out with Andre. He kind of upsets me. There we go. Nice. And then we'll place the chest of Rooney here. Okay. We can 
move pretty much everything. Well, I should probably grab that, but that's fine. Definitely deposit our 36. Nope. Need those bandages. We could definitely deposit <laughs> our 100. Um, it's torches. There. God, I don't know why that was so hard to think to say. All right, that's going to do it for this episode of Enshrouded, I think. Let me just quit. Return to main menu here. I want to do at least one more session in this. Okay, so I have like a week from now. So yeah, I think we'll try to... Ugh. Ugh, sorry. Ugh. Mm. We're going to do at least one more session, one more episode of Enshrouded. Possibly uh, play until the timer runs out, which I think we have like another seven hours to get through. But uh, at least for the first look of Enshrouded, a lot of it's fun. A lot of it, I like the base building. I enjoy the combat, all the themes. It, like it takes like a bunch of like all the stuff like all the um takes like little bits and bobs from like every game and has made it into a fantastic fun game i was kind of skeptical at first because like there's a lot of people talking about enshrouded i'm like oh god here we go uh for some reason i'm skeptical of games being enjoyed for some reason i don't know but <laughs> either way um yeah, that'll do it for this time. Uh, we'll see you in the next time for the Enshrouded Steam Next Fest demo. <laughs>